uh, whenever uh, we are giving counseling to students they often tend to ask this question that is there huge or maybe very high level of uh, mathematics and statistics in all the 13 levels of actuaries so they haven't completed all the 13 levels right so since you have been there in the ground and you have done it so what is the course structure like can you please guide us on that yeah so um, definitely the uh, the course is a little heavier on the mathematics and statistics side but having said that the entire course is not like that um, uh, in the initial few papers while maths and stats is definitely there there is a few bit of accounting and economics as well and as one goes higher up in the cp and sp papers it's more um, problem solving and more of higher order thinking instead of technical uh, uh, concepts as such so um, somebody who's interested in maths and stats that would definitely help in the course but having said that uh, one does not need to be equipped with all the advanced level concepts to take this course okay so uh, like since we all know that in the higher order papers there is not much of number crunching and as we have seen the paper like actuarial practice there is cp2 which is modeling so uh, initially when a student starts they face uh, yes there is a good amount of number crunching in the cm and cs stage but we see a good mix of uh, economics finance right yeah. so yeah so basically as per you there is a good blend of uh, economics mathematics statistics right okay risk management is there yeah. insurance is there okay 